And supposedly we're live. Okay. And supposedly we're live. I'm going to say that again just in case because I've only just seen the uh, the cool bits come up. The, oh wow, we're streaming bits. And, uh, Alright, so we're just going to wait around to see uh, how many people come in. Hopefully the audio sounds fine. I am very bad at the audio. <laughs> uh, um... Oh look, some some wacky guy is streaming right now. Uh... Yeah. That's... I'm so, f I'm so definitely live. Look at a uh, look at all those names coming down. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna be just hanging out for a second as people roll on in, and I'm just gonna keep vamping, cause my name is Dracula. Uh, is this an evil and sad one? We'll find out. I'm probably not gonna do. Um, I'm not gonna do a no mercy route. I'm such a wacky guy. Yep, audio sounds all good, but wait until I introduce more sounds, and then it'll be fun. Yep. So, yeah, um, uh, I haven't been doing much recently, if you, well, I have been doing stuff, uh, not all of it's YouTube, and not all of it's out yet, so, uh, that's been my, that's been my day. This is sus. How dare you accuse me. We're gonna wait a little bit longer. What does this heart button do on the bottom right corner? That's new. Oh, it's just an emoji button. So, okay, so I can make emoji spawn on the side. I, I don't know what the purpose of this is. And I'll leave it at that. Um... Someone wants a raise for Ricky? Okay, so just emojis come out of the button on the side. It's... it's... It's audience interaction. It's audience participation. I don't know what else to say. Um... So yeah, why don't we... Start... Now, um, let me just make sure that everything is organized properly, and clunk. Oh, yeah, that's right, um, give me one second, because, yeah. Oh, gosh, I am the smartest person in this room. It's a very small room, but I am the only one in it. If you could replace any character, <laughs> um, yeah. So, uh, God, I'm slowly. Long ago, two races ruled over the earth of uh, monsters, and one day war broke out. Between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Many years later, legends say that those who climb the mountain. Until this thing is over, until the thing's over.
clunk. Okay. Um, let me just put that up again. Alright, how, how's that? Okay. I'm just I'm just hearing myself through the audio. So this is going to be fun for all of you. Okay, how is this for audio? <laughs> Uh, Mario, the Super Mario Brothers movie. I'm so sorry, guys. There's an echo because I've got a thing playing. Alright, there we are. Um. Ah, oh, crikey. Oh wait, ah oh, shit, give me one second, I have... Ah, I'm so good, I'm so good at everything I do. Okay, I have literally just... Ah, alternatives? Number 17. Dark, darker, yeah. <sighs> Sorry, I'm trying to figure out um, the most basic fucking things. Oh, you're probably hearing all that. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out, um, so there's like the redone OST, and I don't want to put it there, and it's just literally just copy and paste into the... Yeah, hopefully that, that's done the thing I hope it's done. If not, oh no! Um, <laughs> okay. So let's, let's, let's try this. One more time, and it's pre wait. Oh, that's the wrong file. That's the wrong folder. God damn it. <laughs> uh, I'm very, I'm very good at my job. This isn't my job, but I'm very good at it. Play Garden of Peak Peak? No. <laughs> okay, I think I've fixed my problems. Although I'm still sad. So, oh well. Uh, oh god damn it, where's the... There it is. Okay. Let's try this one more time. <laughs> okay. Um, so yeah, am I sounding better now? One day, war broke out between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They 
sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Uh, many years later... Mount Steepit. If you climb the mountain, you die very quiet so I'm just gonna keep god damn it let's just turn okay I've turned my desktop audio down like by 20 dBs so that's got to account for something oh it plays again I didn't have to do any of that I didn't have to ah, whatever Why did Kara fall down the mountain? Are they stupid? Okay. Hopefully I sound good now. If not, fuck. Ugh, goddamn. Yeah, that sounds better. Okay, I'm just gonna trust with that. Um, let's, uh, get rid of that fucking image, and Undertale. So yeah, this is a mod by a bunch of really cool people that I don't know. Um, so. alright, let's name the fallen human. I've, I've seen the chat, I know what you want me to call them, Shrek. Um, so I'm gonna call them. Y'all want me to call them Shrek? I'm gonna call this fucking guy Donkey. The real hero of the movie. Um, K E Y. A donkey. Um, yes, his name is correct. Oh, it's a full-on cutscene. Give me a... Uh, how do I go back into the options, actually? Um... Oh, sweet! It's like a full-on options... Oh my gosh. Uh, let's... yeah. A sepia border. Or dynamic? What the... What do the borders mean? Ah, uh, just keep it safe, yeah. Because it looks pretty, I think. Why do Undertale fan games have the coolest spreads? Yeah, like, this is fucking free. Well, you gotta own Undertale first, but, like, all of this other shit is just free. Like... Oh, we're, we're, we're groovy now, I guess. Howdy! I'm Flowey! Flowey the Flower! Mmm! You're new to the underground, aren't ya? Golly, you must be so confused! Someone ought to teach you how things work around here! I guess little old me will have to do! Ready? Here we go! See that heart? That's your soul, the very culmination of your being! Your soul starts off weak, but can go strong if you gain a lot of LV! What's LV stand for? Why, love, of 
of course! You want some love, don't ya? Don't worry, I'll share some with you! Oh boy, I can't wait. Down here, love is shared through... Little white friendliness pellets! Look at the fucking face he's making. <laughs> Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can! Oh no! Oh fuck! You idiot! In this world, it's kill or be killed! Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Oh no! Die! <laughs> He's chuckling at me. Oh no! Oh, the fires. Okay. What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, uh, do not be afraid, my child. I am Toriel, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if someone has, to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. So yeah, just completely redone sprites and ev. Donkey. I am... This is very impressive just right off the bat. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to... I'm just gonna turn it down for me. Allow me to educate you in the operations of the ruins. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions bet between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move room to room. Please, please adjust yourself to the sight of them. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Ah, fuck, we need to flip a switch. <laughs> it's even got a little X next to it now. Splendid! I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Alright, let's beat this fucker up. Let's fucking give it a chat. You talk to the dummy. Doesn't seem much for conversation. So yeah, I'll do a I'll do a pacifist route because that's a more interesting gameplay. I won! Ah, very good. You are very good. There is another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. One leaf on the ground. Oh. Fro oh, that's, that spread's been redone as well. Okay. Let's give it a compliment. Rocket didn't understand what he said. That was, that was flattered anyway. <laughs> Only true gamers can win against the dummy, indeed. Ooh, let's read the sign. The western room is the eastern room blue room's blueprint. This is the puzzle, but here, take my hand for a moment. Hmm. That's cute. Oh, I love it. Oh, are they gone if you kill him? Oh my god. Uh, that's, that's very cool. That's... 
<laughs> oh gosh. Puzzles are a little bit are a little too dangerous for now. Oh no, eyes are a different colour. You have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Oh fuck! Oh shit! Oh no! Oh fuck! My child, do not worry. I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence, I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone and sneakers. Oh shit, we're getting the running shoes! Oh, I almost forgot to explain those shoes! You can use them to traverse the underground quickly. Simply press X to run. You'll be speeding off in no time. Be careful not to trip, my child. You sense a connection coming from Toriel. I wonder what that sound- what's that? Okay. Now, you know- you all know what we need to do. Say hello. <laughs> this is Toria. You only wanted to say hello? Well then. Hello! I hope that suffices. Hehe. <laughs> yeah, the color, like... <sighs> I'm gonna just be saying this all the time, maybe, but like, yeah, the colors and just how... Yeah, it's just the game, but it's updated, you know? Ugh, anyway, um, ring. Hello, this is Toriel. You have not left the room? You have not left the room, have you? There are a few- there are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them yourself. Be good, alright? Clink. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. It would be funny if Sense's sprite was the exact same. That would be so fucking funny. <laughs> if a monster does not want to fight you, please, use some mercy, human. Ribbit. Playfully crinkling through the leaves fills you with determination. HP fully restored! How'd you, how'd you get that version of the game? Uh, Toby Fox gave it to me, specifically. This frog is observing you closely. <laughs> it says take one. Take a piece of- y you know what we're gonna do. Took a piece of candy. Take one. Took more candy. How disgusting! You take another piece, you feel like the scum of the earth! You took too much too fast! The candy spills on the floor. Look at what you've done! I'm gonna save there. The pain of me stealing that candy rings through the entire game. It's never gonna leave. Ooh, a Whimsom approached meekly. Let's console it. Halfway through the first word, a Whimsom bursts into tears and runs away. <laughs> I won! Yay! Hmm. <gasps> a Sneal! Someone is meticulous clean cleaned all the slime off this snail. Oh. It, I think that'd be worse. You're just it's just a very squishy Oh my god. Hello, this is Toria. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? I honestly have no idea. I've never tasted like either Okay, I've tasted cinnamon, but I have no idea what butterscotch tastes like. So I'm gonna go butterscotch. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, good. Oh. 
You do not dislike cinnamon, do you? I know what your preference is, but... Would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. Give it a compliment. Cinnamon scent. Find it anyway. Ah. I won! I got two gold. Oh, that's really cool. Oh. Hello, this is... You do not have any allergies, do you? Huh? Why am I asking? No reason. No reason at all. Uh, three out of four rocks recommend you push them. Alright, let's see if I can remember this. Up and then. Oh, yeah! First try. Whoop. Eh, well, let's go underground anyway. Hang on, what's over here? Hello? Oh my god, this is just a whole other room. Ribbit, ribbit. Someone has withdrawn the bridge. How? Now my friends and I are separated. Ribbit, someone has got to do something. This is just a whole other room here. Okay. Okay, I genuinely did not know that was there. I, I, I swear, I haven't like... I haven't, like, looked up anything about this mod. Like, the only bits of information I've gotten are just by having played Undertale before. There's a crack in the wall. Oh, we're fighting a dude. A mold small blocked the way. Let's, um, let's try to flirt. You wiggle your hips. Mold small wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. Squarch. I guess that is a bear. I got a gold! Oh, let's see the bit. Whoa there, partner! Who said you could push me around? Hmm? You're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Hmm, that was the wrong direction. <laughs> Okay, I think I got it. Thank you, pal. Ah, you sneaky little bitch. Mm. You want me to stay there? You're giving me a real workout. Ah, that little bitch. Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole to get the cheese, it fills you with determination. Yes! This cheese has been here for quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Where we came off of Morgan? Oh fuck, it's Napst Bloom! Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. With force! Here comes Napster Block. Well, let's give it a check. Detective Fitness. Just wants to seem up for humor. Oh, I'm real funny. Oh, this, oh yeah. This. He gave Napster Block a patient smile. Hey. Just weigh you down. It's all maps to look a little joke. Cheering seems to have improved maps to look smooth again. Let's just keep doing it. 
and F Split wants to show you something. Let me try. I call it Dapper Blook. Do you like it? I like it a lot. I like it so fucking much. Oh, gee. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around. But today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. You sense the connection coming from Napstablook. Can I, like, see the connections I've made? Eh, probably not. Frogit! Ribbit, ribbit. Hello there, human. I am able to tell how much fun you've been having. Let's see here. About 25% fun so far. I hope that was helpful, Ribbit. Ooh, does that mean I get Gorster? Spider Bake Sale. I do not have 18G in the web. <laughs> oh no. Uh, this is going to be terrible for the boss fight later. Oh, oh yeah, I can run. Oh, look at them go. Look at that. Look at that little thing go. Uh, let's talk to it. I don't care! Oh, that's a lot of dudes. Ah, no. Legion! We are Legion! Oh, that's a lot of guys. Oh yeah, I gotta just punch it in the face, don't I? Bop. In unison now! Uh, God, I forgot what you're supposed to do with that guy. Um... Ah, gosh. Sorry. Um... Yeah, okay, so I can't talk with this. I think it is just bopping him on the nose. Let's, let's try that again. I don't think I'm getting, I'm getting this right. Oh, wait, if I just spare it anyway, does that work? Oh, yeah, I forgot. He just wants to hang out. I've heard using F4 can make you have a full screen. But what does F4 stand for? Four frogs? I've only seen a maximum of three frogs in this room. This is troubling to say the least, Rivet. I have heard you are quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now a monster wears a yellow name when you can spell it. What do you think of that? It's very helpful. It's rather helpful. Remember, sparing is just saying that you won't fight. Maybe one day you'll have to do it, even if their name isn't yellow. Look at them go! Look at them go! It's so fast. Oh! Oh, it's a Luke's! Uh, let's not pick on them. Finally, someone gets it! And we gotta avoid the bottles. And we did it, we got five gold. That's had enough to... Oh hey, it's an absolute book again. I fell down a hole and now I can't get up. Go on without me. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. Oh, the ribbon. Let's get that ribbon. That's the wrong room for the ribbon. Vegetoid came out of the earth. Dinner. You pat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. Kachow. Like one HP, my guy? I won. I got so what much fucking gold. All right, let's get that ribbon. 
no 10 HP, I'll be fine. And this is not pick on this guy. <laughs> oh, that was a close one. There we are. I'm so fucking good at this game. Like, they don't call me the Deltarune meme guy if I was bad at Deltarune. Or even not Deltarune. And it shows up on the sprite! Oh my god! <laughs> <clears throat> oh, yeah. Uh, Vegetoid came out of the earth. Let's give it a little little chump with my my mouth. There we are. And four. God damn it. Alright, um. Oh, they're different colors. You lie immobile with mold small. You feel a better understanding of the world. Sexy wiggle. Obey the overmind! He's just having a good time. La la la, just be yourself. He's just having a little groove. Oh, I love that guy. It's the wrong room. <laughs> the greens, yet the carrot is orange. Mm -hmm. Bro, what's up with that? It's fucked up. This game should be banned. I know this puzzle. I... Uh, don't pick on. Finally, someone gets it. There we are. And press the blue switch and be behind this one. Yep, I'm a genius. Why did that one glow? What, what does the purple name mean? That's different. Can I spare them extra hard now? What does the purple name mean? Are they a shiny? Draws near, I'm not gonna pick on Luke's. And I run away. There we are. If you can read this, press the red switch. Switch, press it. I hear a clicking sound. Look at me. Wait, what was that? the wrong one. Luckily, I'm a genius. I'm the smartest man in the galaxy, Morty. I hear a clicking sound, and... Oh, god damn it. I was, like, right out the... God, leave me alone! I'm gonna stop picking on you soon. I'm gonna call you fat. Fucking Mike Wazowski-looking ass. Mold Smalls wiggling in a seductive way. Oh, fuck. <laughs> That's cute. There used to be a bridge here connecting to home, but some ruffians broke it. Now nobody can cross. And the gate is locked too, so there's no way there. Ribbit, ribbit. Human, please find the key to the gate. So yeah, there's just a full-on other area here, I guess. It's a trash can. Wait, or is it a trash can? Oh my gosh. Look out when exploring the sewers, okay? I've heard the Trouble Boys patrol down there. They'll mug you big time. The fucking Trouble Boys? So yeah, just a full-on other area. A very large water pipe. 
Okay, so this is a puzzle, isn't it? Um, ah, gosh damn. So this is a puzzle. I'm gonna say this again. I, I think it's a puzzle. a box? It's a bo- oh. oh! I feel silly now. I thought I had to turn the pipes or whatever. Oh. Yeah, the uncertainty of where the, where the ladder before you leave soon kills your determination. Oh, it's one of the... Uh, it's one of these, isn't it? Hmm, I can't seem to figure this puzzle out. Ah, human, maybe you can help me out. You need to flip the switches and turn them all green. Good luck, Rivet. It's one of these fucking puzzles. Yeah. I'm a fucking genius. Oh, yes, Winston. trouble boys a knife I found a knife uh, I don't... Oh, knife. yeah oh no that's where the trouble boys are isn't it I'm gonna check out what's over here oh hey I did it I save the day. Thank you, human. I can now cross this. Now I can cross this bridge. Finally, my friend and I are connected. All right, let's uh, let's go fuck up the trouble, boys. <laughs> Wait, is there something down here, or is it's just more water? All right, trouble, boys. Oh, it's a key. Oh, oh no! Haha! <laughs> 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 Look who fell for it! Thought you could just come in here and take the key, did ya? Not today! Not today, I say! Hitch! Go easy on them! Hitch, go easy on them! They probably just want to get home! Quiet, portable! You're ruining our awesomeness! We call ourselves the Trouble Boys, see? We're the baddest boys on the block. The troublest tyrants in town. We are? Yes, Porta B. We are. We've been over this. Enough stalling. Prepare to be mugged. Big time. The double troublemakers trample in. All right. I think Portable is the leak is the weak link. Let's comfort it. Give Portable a big embracing hug. Oh, he's so warm, thank you. Just head over the goods or else. Oh, I can't see where the balls are going if the glasses are there. Okay. Motivate? Just say some generic encouraging words, but it doesn't do much. Huh? I don't get it. We're stronger than any human. This is a banger track. Portable size loudly. Okay, um. What if we roll it? That's. But it feels discouraged. No, I don't want to. Oh, that's a. Oh, oh no. Oh, I, I took so much damage. It smells like trouble. Uh, let's try comforting again. It's a 
do it. I dodged it. Okay, let's, let's give him more comfort. Oh no. You know, I need some food. Let's take a monster candy. There we are. Oh no, he's just chucking bottles at me. Um. Okay, that's still just kind of, okay. Okay, we need to we need to deal with Hitch now. Fuck. Um, let's praise. Tell Hitch that you're the worst, best, worst criminal you've seen. I think that was an insult. <laughs> I know I am. Okay. Okay. Let's take another monster candy. We are grooving. I like those trouble boys a bit. It smells like glass. Oh, you guys are silly. It's a hitch. Let's give it a, a lecture. You scold hitch. Says that you should stop his wrongdoings. Heh, <laughs> I don't feel like it. Oh, I was so close to getting hit. Pat? Attempt to pat Hitch around to sort of pay hands off. It's just, uh, it's just one fucking duck. But that homie ain't no gangster. Um, if I check them? Ah, uh, I'm lost. Ah, <laughs> uh, mm. Okay, so now portable can roll. What is up with this one attack? I feel like something's missing from it. <laughs> and, and he succeeds! Hey, I did it! I really did it! Portable's feeling great. <laughs> Fuck. And, uh, okay, what if I... Okay, that didn't work. Uh, I'm gonna be stuck in this boss for a while just because I have no idea how to comfort so Okay, what if I lecture them now? see them fucking die, do we? Oh no, we saw them fucking straight up fucking die. Oh, this fucking puzzle. Okay. Clonk. I forgot how it works. No way, I remember perfectly, because I'm a genius. Let's 
Pick up that knife. Okay, so let's, um, lecture him. Why is there just, like, one attack that's just, like, a single duck? So I give him a hug. Like, I, I feel like there's something missing here. I've said this before, but... <laughs> okay, now we're up for the fucked up attack. Oh yeah. Collection? fucked up on the, that attack the first time. <laughs> okay, now I fucked up. And... Oh, yeah. <laughs> God damn... What do I... <sighs> do I have to comfort them multiple times in a row? Isn't on a roll. Oh, okay, so I try to pat him, then he asks for a hug, then I give him a hug, and then they feel motivated enough to fucking... Okay, then they get a hug. I I know how to deal with Toriel. <laughs> fucking- ah! What did I do before? What, did, what, what worked? Attacking with vodka? Ugh, I'm not very smart, am I? <laughs> He's struggling to stay upright. Oh, I think I got a lecture in the punch because. He currently likes Porta B. You might need some comforting. Oh, okay. Now if we pat them. Can I get a pat two and then oh. so much broken glass. Oh, nice. No prop. Oh, no, 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 no. I only have 4 HP. I can't fucking lose to the trouble, boys. Okay. I should call it quits. Okay, can we spare them now? Oh no, we gotta we gotta motivate the guy. Got Ah This is so annoying. What are we sized up? 
Can we pump him? Okay, okay, so... Feels discouraged. No, I don't want to. Oh. Oh, the wheels. Motivate? Oh, there we are. Okay, so I asked them to roll, then I motivate them. I'm not smart. I swear to God. Okay, there we go. And... It's on the roll. Then they succeed. And then... Um, oh, no. The boys are no longer tr- I did it! <laughs> 30 gold! Alright, we give in. Thanks for helping us out. We really needed it. If only there was some way we could repay you. I think they were looking for to get that key. Oh, right. Almost forgot. <laughs> I'm betting you're desperate to get out of this stinking place, so it's all yours. Well, anyways, that's all. See you around, kid. Took the key and put it in your pocket. Woo! We did it, gang. We defeated the Trouble Boys in Mortal Kombat. Where does this door lead? I want it opened. Get, get, okay. Ribbit, ribbit. That lever over there. Would you please pull it for me, human? I don't have hands, so I can't do it myself. Ugh. All right. <laughs> I still can't get over the running animation. It looks so goofy. Uh, wins and terrorize. Can't handle this. Oh, oh no, 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 no! I'm not fucking dying here. We're fleeing. Oh, thank god. Alright, we're going back through the- What are you gonna say? Uh, ah! <laughs> Go away. I hate rock puzzles. I can never choose which one to push. How you doing, partner? Ain't things easier when you just ask? Oh, I can finally donate to the spider bake sale. Nah. Oh, I get a good Oh, I got a jump. And we're speed running. This is what happens when you speed run. You're so easy to deal with, my guy. There we are, and... After dealing with them trouble boys... So just... Alright. So let's, um, let's open the gate. The gate is unlocked, even the key. Open the gate. Hello? No audio here. Wait, what the... Oh, it's a big room now. What? It's just a whole fucking other area! It's a large statue of some famous monster. His name on the plaque seems to have been worn away. Oh no! I'm... 
I'm just crying here. Nothing but tears from this limsom. I mean, there's a lot from a lot else from other limsoms. There's a fucking shop. Oh, it's the kid we met down in the sewer. How you doing? We work in the store when we're not hanging around town. Well, we're not gonna pick out pick out your items for you, bud. Tell you what, take your pick of the store, kid. Not like anyone else is gonna be taking them anytime soon. Thanks for, thanks for changing his mind about bullying thing. Sassy. It's a pocket room full of plastic fruit toys. A field of stoic onions spread out before you. Take one? Yeah, let's take out a fucking onion. You can still bear free stoic onions. There's milk and pee. I wonder if I check every single milk for expiration dates. Go ahead and sue me. From afar, this looks like a doorway to Sistopheles. Upon further inspection, however, it's just painted on the wall. It's a croquet bowl. Please be a yeah, let's take the bowl. Let's take some more fucking onions. Oh no, I'm carrying too much. So what does the croquet bowl do? Oh. Oh, it's a croquet roll. I wasted that item. <laughs> Whoops. Ah, it's ta is that time already? The other crabs aren't. Huh? Have I been mistaken? Hmm, you aren't the one I'm looking for. There's a fellow that comes by once a month and plays the harmonica. His plays the harmonica. Every time, always exclaiming it's time for crab and doing a fancy jig. Is this the crab rave? Hmm. <sighs> Give you some advice. You might want to explore this area as much as you can while down in the underground. Monsters like to expand their home up. That area is the main pop and Fucking Borgly. Fucking Borgla. If you're trying to get into. <clears throat> if you're trying to get into the building for the main doors, you ought to give up. There's no way to get. Into the... There's no way to get in. Attention home residents, due to a recent scuffle in the main access way, it will remain closed until the new floor shrine has been dried completely. Home, our grand capital. Note the capital has been re relocated to new home. <laughs> More spider. Alright. Fucking... I'm Newbert! Everybody loves me! You shot my man while Newbert and you partake in finger gun shooting. Ne how Newbert managed to pull off finger guns is unknown. Ah, fucking love Newbert. Best character. That's... It's just a regular spiderweb. Oh, might seem old, but it's still full of life. The name fits for sure, as many monsters call this place their home. The Guardians of the Ruins, Toriel, helps out the community from time to time. Though, in recent years, she's been spending more and more time somewhere else. Yeah, we all fucking love moving. You know, I'll take to say this song is kind of inconsistent in terms of quality. Let's figure out a secret way into this. Is there a secret way or is there just no way to get into here? Hmm. What a big building. Oh, man. Leave me be, human. I'm busy training my in my mind palace. <laughs> Actually, fun fact, I have just rewatched all of Sherlock again. It still sucks. So I guess I can't go into that. <laughs> I think that's everything, huh?
holds a big fucking room. Oh, you've already unlocked the gate. You have my thanks, human. Okay, I guess let's go hang out with Toriel. Oh dear, that I took that took longer than I thought it would. Huh? How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Not a scratch. Impressive, but still. I should not have left you alone for so long. I had to deal with the fucking trouble boys all by myself. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Uh, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. You feel like your connection to Toriel is growing deeper. Hi, him. It's called Moon Balls. Can you spell that? Surprise! It is the butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold, hold off the snail pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. She is quick. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Is something burning? Um, make yourself at home. Oh, and it's got the Azrael colors as well. A tissue box to wipe your sorrows away. Look at these cool toys. They don't interest you at all. The closet is empty. It seems someone has moved the clothes somewhere else. An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. A box of kid shoes. A disparity of sizes. When does Ububa come out? When does Ububa come out? <laughs> Where's a booba? <laughs> yeah, this mod is really cool. Small picture, you can't even make out what it's a picture of. <laughs> I haven't seen Cyber Plan before, but you do not know its name. <gasps> it's you! It's a book about snails. It's open at a random page. Snails are passive creatures, or so it seems. There is no research on whether or not they wish for our demise at every moment. That's enough snail facts for one day. <laughs> room under renovations. Ooh, it's a bathroom. It's a sink for washing your hands and brushing your teeth in. There seems to be some wipe first stuck in the drain. Ugh. A couple of hygiene products on the walls, bathroom shampoo, hand soap, conditioner, a gallon full of burp cleaner. Sadly, there are no rubber ducks to be seen. It's a toilet. It doesn't look like it's been used in a long time. Nobody is around to stop. You flush the toilet. Well, let's see here. There's nothing inside. Disappointed, you slam the lid shut. What do you mean the toilet has been used in a long time? It's Toriel's diary. Read the circled passage? Yeah, why not? You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. It's an encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flower plants with brown oblong seed sepoids, more commonly known as water sausages. You peek inside. Scandalous. It's Toriel's sock drawer. Ah, the cactus. Truly the most secondary of plants. <laughs> <sighs> Definitely bigger than the twin size bed. These books are worn. They must have been read many times. Oh, there's a hat. Oh, I can't look at the picture. 
It's a coat hanger. Looks like it hasn't been used in a long time. Only Toriel wears coats in this situation. Inside is a long calendar from the beginning of 2000... 2001X. Ugh. Oh, it's bigger on the inside. It was bigger. It's a small television. It's turned off. It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Far, far into the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named Home. As great as our king is, he's pretty lousy at names. Another me! It's you! Fireplaces and burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You can put your hand inside. Oh, it's the layout of the... It's a house phone. You try to make a call. It's broken. <laughs> it's, this is the layout of the... <sighs> yes, this is the layout of the house in Deltarune. That's cool. Take a look inside the, of the drawer. Nothing but a lone, faded green crayon. I recognize that. Ah, they should have an interaction for that. There are many books. Tales of Snails, a storybook. Snails have tails, a thesis. And various other snail-related literature. <laughs> for some reason, there's a brand new... There's a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. The ends of tools have been filed down to make them safer. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Aww. It's a trash can. It's full of open, empty seat packets. There's some white fur stuck in the train. The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. The stove top is very clean. Toriel must have used fire magic instead. Inside the covers are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. Inside the covers are there's more cookie bread monsters. Oh, a box of crowns and paper. From one drew Luke some whimsome too. That's cute. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know that how glad I am to have someone here. There's so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I've always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? What? This, this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? Sure. Here's an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails sometimes flip their di digestive systems as they mature? Interesting. I don't exit the ruins. I have to do something. Stay here. You just walked right through me. You gave me too much sneaker power. Oh, we got that. Oh, there's boxes here. You wish to return. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now, be a good child and go upstairs. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child. If you, re if you leave the ruins, they... Asgore will kill you. I am only protecting you, do you understand? Go to your room. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. 
You want to leave so badly? <laughs> you are just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me that you are strong enough to survive. Oh shit. Oh, they haven't changed it. Toriel blocks the way. Gotta spare him. Oh, you can flee? Yes. Oh, that was the wrong way to go. Tells like bits and pieces. There are new areas you miss, Spring Bonnie. At least it textured correctly. I am saying it correctly. What are you proving this way? Ugh, relaxing. Victoria looks for you. Fight me or leave. Stop it! Oh. Stop looking at me that way! Go away! new funky Kong mode. Oh, wrong person. Gotcha. I know you want to go home, but... But please, go upstairs now. I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but we can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please, go upstairs. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. Hmm. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectan- my expectanliness. My lonely situations, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Where's the funny bone man? Just wait like five fucking minutes! Goodbye, my child. We did it. We got through the first bit of the game. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. <laughs> 
I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die, and you'll die, and you'll die. Until you tire of trying, what will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it. I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. This is so much more interesting. <laughs> Fucked up, little guy. Oh no, my border is gone. I haven't changed it. Huh? There's a camera hidden in the bushes. The cold atmosphere of a new land. It fills you with determination. Alright. I'm gonna take a big sip of water. Because I'm a bit parched. all the sex I'm having. I'm back. Oh, it's a stick. Oh no. No, I didn't. I didn't have that before. Oh shit. Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. <laughs> the old whoopee cushion and the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans a skeleton. Who's the funny bone man? It's a funny bone man. I'm the seraph of these <laughs> Fuck yeah. Nah, I'm just kidding. Oh, we're gonna grease cart. I'm actually supposed to be wa on watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over here, over there. I have an idea, I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. What's up, bro? You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles! You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Just staring at this lamp. It's really cool. You wanna look? 
No, I do not have any time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Respect. Recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sands, you are not helping, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton? Hey, Sans? Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it. Sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much to get some recognition? Well, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. Hey. Ah! I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little bit more backbone into it. <laughs> okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does... You'll have to sit for more of my hilarious jokes. It's some sort of checkpoint or a sentry station. But the bottles are but the bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish are sitting inside. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking. My brother's been kinda down lately. He's never seen a human before. And seeing you might just and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. I sense a connection coming from Smans. Well, they haven't changed, Snowy. I'll put the butterscotch pie into it because I'm saving it for marriage. <coughs> Let's put that toy knife away. This is a box. You can put an item inside to take an item out. Silly. A box lover. Ooh, Snow Drake. Okay. Check. Yeah. Better not snow flake out. And let's uh, laugh at his joke. We laugh at his joke. Yes, he laughs at that. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in. All that's attached is a. Wait, there's another. Ah, there's another path on the other side of the. Ah, there's more! Call me, use my number. You decide not to call. So, as I was saying about Undyne... <laughs> Sands, oh my god, is that... a human? <laughs> uh... Actually, I think that's a rock. Oh. Hey. Sat in front of the rock. Oh my god! Is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! Undyne will! I'm gonna. I'll be so popular! 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 Ahem. Human! You shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will capture you. I will then capture you. You, you will be delivered to the capital. Then, then, I'm not sure what's next. 
In any case, continue. Only if you dare! <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built it this, you ponder? I bet it was that very famous Royal Guardsman! No, not yet a very famous Royal Guardsman. Yes. Ice cap struts into view. Ignore. Looks annoyed. What? What are you doing? Tried to steal Ice Cap's hat and succeeded. It melts in your hands. I, I. Ice. You inform Ice Cap that it still looks fine. I wanted you to see me as cool. Ice Cap doesn't mind its identity. Let's... You won. I earned 35 gold. Wait, what does the sign say? That was. It's a sign. Part of it's been written on <laughs> red marker. Rebellious Teen Club. Up. Snowden. Right. Uh, we're, we're gonna experience more trouble, boys? Heh. <laughs> Sorry, kid. Big bur big kids only, you know. Come back when you're a little, mmm, older. <laughs> Fuck. something move was in my imagination. I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Ooh. Check. Attack 13. Move an inch! I love this music so much. Doggo some can't seem to find anything. You pet doggo! What? I've been pet! Pet, 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 pet. Doggo has been pet. This is something pet me! Something that isn't moving! I'm gonna need some dog treats for this! He smoked them. Oh, I'm smoking dog treats. Holy fuck, it smans. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red. So, I am- so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Ugh. <laughs> I fucking love this slide animation. I'm not petting it like 20 times over. I'm good. Oh wow, look at that. Oh, you can see the capital in the distance. No, I'm a snowman. I wanna see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveler, please take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Thank you so much. Good luck. Well, hello. That skeleton over there just told me how to dodge orange attacks. What are you saying? Something like traffic lights have free lights on them. The third light and the green one means go. The first light, the red one, means stop. Second light, the yellow one, means yield. In that order, dodge. 
In order to dodge an orange attack, you must be moving. So just think of it this way. Red and yellow lights together make orange. Then you obey the rule of the leftover green light, which means go. Easy, huh? Just think of red and yellow traffic lights, which is actually green. Yeah. He started talking about plaid attacks. <laughs> You're so lazy! You were napping all night! I think this call. Sleeping? Excuses, excuses! Oh, the human arrives! In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sounds like fun. Because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. Sands, what did you do? Give me one second. Uh, sorry about that. What did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. <laughs> hold this, please. <laughs> okay, try now. Oh, can you get shot? Ah, <laughs> nice. Incredible, you slippery snail! You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It will. It is designed by my brother, Sans. You will be surely confounded. I know I am. <laughs> hey, thanks. You all seem like you're having fun. By the way, did you see the weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother the cool? Isn't my brother cool? <gasps> I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. <laughs> oh, a customer. Hello, would you like some nice cream? A frozen treat that warms your heart. And I do not have any items. Okay, let's see. Can I get this in? Because I know it shrinks, doesn't it? Come on. Fuck. Oh, okay, come on. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. Purple, even when you felt trapped, you took notes and achieved the end of ball. You're awarded 2G. Me. I've been thinking about selling treats, too. Want some fried snow? Just 5G. Yeah, you're right. I should charge way more than that. You know, I thought he was, like, pissed off or sick or something, but it's just a hat. It's conveniently shaped snow puff. Hey, hands off the merch, kid. Is this way? Nope. Oh. His. Hers. Sweet. This video game. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow dodecahedron. 
Human, I hope you're ready for... To answer where's the puzzle? Right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Sansa didn't do anything! Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you'd said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really, dude? That was easy peasy. That easy peasy word scramble. That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Humans must be very intelligent! If they also find Junior Jumble so difficult. <laughs> hey, thanks for saying Junior Jumble just to appease my brother. Yesterday you got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. right now. It's game time! He's a gamer now. Snow from Papyrus. Oh wait, that's the normal one? Or... Is that always that? That wasn't always that, wasn't it? This is new. Oh, hello. Oh, don't mind me. I'm just waiting for the ice to melt. Can't go fishing on a frozen pond, huh? Actually, you can, I think. Isn't that a thing that people do? Like ice fishing, where they like cut a hole into the lake and then they fish? Oh, my homies hate Jerry. Warning, dog marriage. powdery food and licks his hands loudly. You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks away. Jerry. Just Jerry when it looks away. I won! I got $13 redos. Some sort of checkpoint or sentry station. Someone's face is clearly imprinted on the counter. It appears Sans has comp- It appears Sans has competition. Phew, I made it on time. Not a minute late. I wouldn't want to be late on the first day of my new position. Come to think of it, why they even shift around sentry rotation anyway? I saw some- some of the canine unit out here. They're so cute, I can't help but pet them. I didn't ask. I hope it was alright. <laughs> uh. Oh, I can't go up there. Oh. Oh, yeah. There's a switch in the snow. Click. No, it's time for dog marriage. What's that smell? Where's the smell? If you're really a smell, identify your smell. F hmm. Here's that weird smell. Makes me want to go eliminate. Eliminate you! <laughs> Roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Do humans have tail? Let's get human tail. Yeah.
Oh, the dog sniff you again. After rolling in the dirt, you smell all right. Smells like a... What are you, actually, a little puppy? I fucking love this music. <laughs> you pet dog Amy. Wow! Pet by another pup! Well, don't leave me out! Oh, it has the dog song in it! Dog Aressa. Dog's mind had been expanded. <laughs> oh, that was great. Dogs can pet other dogs? A new world has opened up for us! Thanks, weird puppy. I was so good at this fucking game. Shut up! <laughs> uh. What? How did you avoid my trap? And, more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you want to tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? I ate it. Really? Wowee! No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then, fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> yeah. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do. Without such a cool guy taking care of him. Oh, I love the glasses. <laughs> oh, oh, there's a laser. Human! Hmm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze the ground, so now the solution is different. And, as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I, suppo I suppose what I'm saying is, worry not, human. I, the great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try to... I'll try not to give them away the answer. Oh, that is not the right answer! Oh, we're gonna go again. God damn it. That's alright, you can try as many times as you like. Alright. did it without my help. Incredible! I'm impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. <laughs> and off he goes. Those flowered. The evil nemesis flowered. <gasps> Fuck yes! <sighs> Crikey. Vimeo games. Truly. Oh, sweet. That's where the. That's where that goes. Oh. Oh, that's a lot of people. Ice Captain Snow, <laughs> you sighing, Jerry. Okay, let's just ignore Ice Cap. Hmm. 
Opa. And oh, oh no. Oh no. I'm not talking very much. I am. Okay, there we are. Uh, did they ditch me? Okay, I'm gonna turn it off and turn it back on again, uh, cause that was weird. Oh, that's so annoying. Alright.
Oh my fucking god, I just... Oh, shit, I selected the wrong thing. Oh, that's... Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I turned my mic off. I turned my mic off instead of the setting the stream up thing. Oh my gosh. You saw nothing! <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh. Oops. I- no, I'm fine. I just clicked the wrong button. I know the dog will never try to get on making the photo snow dog. There's no snow dog. Oh, hey. I was staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. <laughs> Oops. Redo the whole thing? Nah, I can't, sorry. I'm not redoing it, like, for a third time. Also, you didn't really miss much, except for the big puzzle part. Anyway, that dog is just an artist, so let her... Ooh. Oh, yeah, down here. <laughs> it's a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word sans written on it in red marker. <laughs> uh, this game. Let's try to get to that snowman over there. Okay, I guess I can't. Let's see if I can remember the solution. Ah. I don't. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. I got it now. Oh, the cool little slide. Oh, hey, there's Puppy. What's up? Say, are you following me? Oh shit. The griff trot. Undecorate. That's a little better. That's a little better. The weight has been lifted. Neat. Ah, oh, fucked up door still here. Say, are you following me? It's a snow puff. And this is the snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Is it really a snow puff? Behold! A snow puff. Eh? There's 30G inside this. What is this? Ugh. It's a greater dog. And the greater dog inches closer. The greater dog just wants affection. Pet it. Curls up in your lap and it's pet by you. So comfortable it falls asleep. And it wakes up. It's so excited.
Make a snowball and throw it before the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Pretty dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now the dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. God damn it. Pretty dog wants some TLC. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight into you. Your movement's slow, but you still haven't pet enough. Pet capacity is at 40%. Red dog is contented. Uh, yeah, I don't know. That sprite isn't as intimidating, like, isn't as, like, funnily intimidating as the original. But it's still good sprite work. Come now! Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge! Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror! When I say the word, it will fully activate! Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will... Each part will swing violently up and down! Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm about to activate it now. It uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Anyway, away it goes! Phew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus! Nyeh. Eh! Eh? I don't know what my brother's gonna do now. If I were you, I'd make sure I understand blue attacks. Welcome to Snowden. Oh, welcome to Snowden. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Welcome, traveler. Please check out that cell. Oh, there's a little room here now. Mighty. <laughs> it has apps on it. Alright, need a... Alright, let's, let's put the snowman piece in just to be nice. Oh, we did buy the nice cream. Alright, let's get the mighty bandana. The manly bandana. Who's there? 
I'm in the middle of my favorite TV program. I know, I know. Staring at a screen sounds like a boring hobby, but the TV offers an escape to another world. We really need that. That lady over there, something about her disturbs me. Isn't my, isn't my little cinnamon bun the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable, teehee. I think I figured it out. Nope, never mind. Awful teams tormented a local monster by decorating his tree like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath decorated trees. They have like, they just like accidentally invented Christmas. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. I wonder if that weird skeleton is an adult or a kid. This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. Welcome to Grill Beats. Enjoy your stay. The sign is a bit greasy. <laughs> no, gross. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help, I oh, want new drinks and hot guys. Oh, isn't human food different from monster food? Those things like to spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. Capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving down here. Hmm. I don't want to see the erasure of the local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip on their butts. Hey, it's the Sans theme. Ah, water. Those dogs are a part of the, Lord, the Royal Guard, the elite military troop led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. No wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. I put a line out for some girls today. Someone told me there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. Everyone is, already la is always laughing, cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crises. Dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm not very funny. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? You aren't gonna make me the human again, are you? Simply monsters and humans. Ah, to be young again. The world sure felt boundless. Oh, look at him go! It's the guy who froze ice! Ooh, that water isn't looking very finished. Oh, hello. Hello? speak to G. Wait a second. Is this the wrong number? Oh, it's the wrong number song. The wrong number song. We're very sorry. We got it wrong. Oh, it's the wrong number. The wrong number song. We're very sorry that we got it wrong. Clink. I guess that was my fun event. The library. Ugh. Ugh, sorry. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know the sign is misspelled. I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. Cough, cough. When I was younger, my teachers gave me the word searches when they ran out of assignments. Oh, they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Now look in your eye. You're someone that has difficulty solving Junior Jumble, aren't you? 
Oh, I love this game. It's unlocked. Wait, it's unlocked? Then why can't I go in? Let me in. It's a mailbox overrun with unread junk. A mailbox labeled with papyrus. Inside. It's empty. Oh, that's a shame. Ooh, it's time. Human! Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the admiration for another's puzzle solving skills, the desire to have a cool, smart person think that you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the Great Papyrus, will be your... No. No, this is all wrong! I can't be your friend! You are a human! I must capture you, then I can fulfill my lifelong dream! Powerful, popular, prestigious! That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard! Oh. Let's flirt with him. What? Flirting? you finally reveal your ultimate feelings? Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards! Oh no, you're meeting all of my standards! I guess this means I have to go on a date with you? Let's date later, after I capture you. Oh fuck, that attack almost got me. So you won't fight. Then, let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack! <laughs> You're blue now! That's my attack! <laughs> oh, fuck, I'm blue now. I'm blue double D double die. Hmm, I wonder what I should wear. I'm playing fucking Super Mario Bros. Maker right here. You know, I actually tried to create a Papyrus uh, Mario Bros. Maker level like years ago. Like Mario Maker for the Wii U. Um, it didn't end up uh, well. <laughs> Yeah, it didn't end up going up there because I didn't know how to actually solve it <laughs> or finish it. I can almost taste my future popularity! Papyrus, head of the Royal Guard! Ooh, sick moves. Papyrus! Unparalleled Spaghettator! Oh, nuts. <laughs> Undyne will be really proud of me! Oh, nuts. Ooh, we're gaming now. Yogurt? The king will trim a hedge in the shape of my smile! Well, Pyrus is realizing he doesn't have any ears. My brother, well, he won't change very much. We gotta do small hops. 
vampires is rattling his bones. I'll have lots of admirers, but... Will anyone like me as sincerely as you? You is really rare. And dating might be kind of hard. After you're captured and sent away. Attack. Ah! Who cares? Give up! Oh, slick. Give up or face my special attack! Special attack! Thank god there's not like a harder version of this fight anywhere in the game. I need to stop on you there. Oh, 5 HP. This is your last chance before my special attack! Stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack! Oh well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. <laughs> just a regular attack. Ah, here's an absolutely normal attack. really healed. It's a really cool normal attack, by the way. Whoa. Dude. I did it! The special attack is over. Well, it's clear that you can't defeat me! Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots! Therefore I, the great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human! Now's your chance to accept my mercy! I can't even stop someone as weak as you! Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and... My friend quantity will remain stagnant. Let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess... I guess I can make an allowance for you. 
Wowee! We haven't even had our first date! And I've already, and I've already managed to hit the friend zone! Who knew all I needed to make pals? was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them! You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through, and I'll give you directions to the surface, continuing forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, you'll reach the capital, across the barrier, that's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul! Like you! That's why the king wants to acquire a human! He wants to open the barrier with the soul power! Then us monsters can return to the surface! Oh, I almost forgot to tell you! To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters! He is... Well, he's a big fluffy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I'm certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. <laughs> You feel like you, your connection with Papyrus is growing deeper. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna do the Papyrus uh, side quest. But I need to... I need to use the bathroom. I will be back in a second and won't just delete my microphone again. Uh, so... And I return glistening! Alright, so... Okay, there's also that, like, one section at the start where we couldn't get through because uh, we needed to be older. 
And I wonder if I can get back there, if I could potentially just, um, get through because I am older. Wait, have I, have I done it properly? Yes, I have. I haven't. <laughs> oh, I've done it properly. Hi. They all live in the woods, so no one can tell us what to do. Now everyone ignores us. I don't want freedom if it means no one's going to pay attention to me. <laughs> oh, hey. Done it properly? It, wait. Yeah, I've done it properly. I'm gonna take the headphones off. Okay. Yeah, that's good. So yeah, let's see if uh, we can pass through that, that that gang of bullies. Could he do the Susie voice? I can do it whenever I want! Alright, let's see if... <gasps> oh. Oh, yeah, there we are. But are you tough enough for this? <laughs> the chill drakes flutter forth. Rebels against everything. Afraid of the light? Turn some music up all the way. Never do your homework. It's all chill, chill drakes. It's all wrong. Defiance can't be defied! Rush my way? What? I forgot how to spare these guys. <laughs> Actually, death? Wait, does the other chill drake have different options? Nope. I, what do I do? Yeah, if I'm probably asking, then yeah, it's fine. Uh, yeah, I got this from Game Jolt. It's on the page. It's free. You just need the original Undertale, and you can go at it. It's cool.
Oh, okay, so I have to agree with it after performing a neutral action. No way in heck! Alright. I agree with Shit and Drake. Seems to get very uncomfortable. Tell you the truth. Oh, there we are. I did it. 20 bucks. Uh, well, I guess that sells it. Yeah, uh, I guess you're a part of the club or something. Just, uh, don't tell the other teams about this, okay? Say something funny. Badoobies! Gazubat. 9-11. What he said, it'll ruin our reputation. All right. I guess we're in the cool part of the game. The cool kids. Oh, this is nice. Cool slime sounds. That was my cool slime sound. It's a broken television. The only thing displaying on the screen is your reflection. There are remains of many drop of roast marshmallows in this fire pit. We politely pay respect to the fallen. <laughs> Yo, new kid, I got some good news for ya. We've achieved victory against an ice cream man. My little sib says he's moved to the waterfall, but I'm skeptical. It's a red bicycle with a golden basket attached to the front. It's a green bicycle. It looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. Is this the part where we see Susie? Is this the part where we see Susie Delta Ring? It's a vending machine. There are several brands of chips to buy. Even if you had the money, it doesn't seem to work. Oh! Oh, is this it? Oh, there's a kite up there. Hey, not now, kid. You're not going to make us look like losers. I mean, I've never met this human in my entire life. <laughs> cool. Well, that was neat. <laughs> I love the slide animation. Sonic's voice? Haha! <laughs> Cocaine! That wasn't it, but eh. Strike a post aside? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Us teens live self-sufficiently off the fat of the land. Oh, and the box lunches my parents bring, bring us every day. <laughs> Let's go date Papyrus. What are you? Huh? Don't mind me. I just got back from my fishing trip. As it turns out, you can't fish on a frozen pond. <laughs> uh. So, you came back to have a date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special! A place I like to spend a lot of time! Do the, do the Obama voice? Uh, let me be clear. Hmm? 
my house! This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. It's a, it's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down, move it! Okay. You moved it two inches! Move it to your room! Okay. And don't bring it back! Okay. It's still here! Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it! Ooh, it's my favorite game show! Says so stay tuned for a new program. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode, don't judge me! Touch the couch. It makes a jangling sound. Find some loose coins on the couch. You got 20G. <laughs> Ugh. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. It's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. Welcome to Scenic My House! Enjoy and take your time! Oh, let's do the bit. Wowee! Being a good host is a real workout! My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried baking something. It was like a quiche, but filled with a sugary non-egg substance. How absurd. That's the trash can. Feel free to visit anytime. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. What? Catch that meddling canine! Curses! Sands! Stop plaguing my life with incidental music! Oh shit. The Dog Shrine. Dog Shrine. Donate. Put 1G into the box. I feel like you're about to wait a lot of time. The box is full. Looks like the money was used to buy some fairy lights. It was kind of dark in here. Zero G4. Dark Nate. Donate. Just believe it sounds correct. Ooh. Dumplings, they look slightly different. Looks like the dog didn't like them very much. So far, the donation money has been totally wasted. <laughs> Alright. It's time to dognate. Oh, sweet. Some kind of inflatable mascot. Donate all your Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm doing. It's not clear how this is going to encourage more to anyone to donate. Alright. The donating speed run. <gasps> A framed photo of Papyrus. Looks like he's having fun making some kind of pasta. Back to the dognate grind. <gasps> the shrine got bigger. Dognot, you feel a sense of relief. 
Alright, back to the dog nading. <laughs> the boombox is playing an upbeat song. It's having a psychological effect on your desire to donate. It's not clear what kind of effect that is. Change the track? Another... The next track is just the same, but faster. <laughs> Fucking love this game. Yeah, so this is, um, content from the Xbox version. Or the PlayStation? I don't remember. I don't know that the... I don't know that the Switch version has, like, an extra boss, so I wonder if that's still in this version of the game. Looks like the dog just bought a CD for the boombox, but it's a game CD, so it won't work. <laughs> Fucking love this. Where I got that dog Nate grind set. I am dog pilled. I am dog Nate maxing. Okay, sweet, the box is cool. <laughs> a frame photo of Papyrus. It's a bit blurry, but it looks like he's actually chasing the photographer. <laughs> Alright. How much money do I have left? Oh, I got, I got a lot of money. How much do I- Okay, I have 174. I'm not gonna lose much. The dog has spent all the money on a piece of rope. <laughs> However, it's really not that much more rope for the amount spent. <laughs> Seems like the dog got ripped off. <laughs> this is so funny. Back on the grind. Does the dog shrine like on PC? There's no dog shrine on PC, that's like a console exclusive. I think it's like either exclusive to micro to the Xbox version or the um or the PlayStation version, I can't remember. I know that one version is something dip like uh eh, I don't know. Alright, 30G in the box. Dognating. Ah, oh, dognating. Oh, we love our dognating. Rise and dognate. Come on. <laughs> it's a tap to dispense dog food. So, is there a tank full of dog food in the walls? Alright. Zero of the 35G. Let's go, gamers. Yeah, yeah, I know that. Yeah, like the, it's Mimi down here in some secret shrine. <sighs> oh sweet, okay. The box is full. Okay. <laughs> huh? Blueprints? Literally. It's white paper but covered in little blue paw prints. Wait, blue paw prints. Could it be a clue? No? It's totally useless. Okay, 40. Let's go. This is what we've all been waiting for, gamers. Thank you. 
Okay, sweet. It's, an <laughs> it's another piece of rope! It's not even any bigger than the last one! What are you spending my money on? But we always got a dog, Nate. So to recap, this mod has updated graphics, exclusive features, re-added new music, new side quests, new rooms, new... and new secret bosses. Okay, halfway there, come on. I don't think a lot of the gamers are enjoying this so far. Bro's got infinite money? Wait, what? Not enough money? Wait, did- I fucking lost all my money?! Fuck! Oh shit. Oh, that's embarrassing. Oh well! <laughs> oh, that's very funny of me. A classic image! It always reminds me of what's important in life. That's my room! If you finish looking around, we could go in and go in and do whatever people do when they when they date. It's time for dating. Ooh. Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. Even though it was basically even though it basically just happened. That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair, sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead I and so instead, I cruise while I snooze. Ah, yes. Action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from... A chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa! Isn't that flag just neato? Undyne found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. <laughs> That book's one of my favorites! Advanced Puzzle Constructions for Critical Minds. That next book's another one of my favorites! Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. There are no skeletons inside my closet! Except me sometimes. Look inside the closet? Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Oh. The internet. I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit follower count. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona. I always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Okay, dating start! Here we are, on our date! I've actually never done this before, but don't worry, you can spell- you can't spell prepared without several letters from my name! I snagged an official dating rulebook from the library. We're ready to have a great time! Yeah, let's see. 
F1, press C on your keyboard for your dating HUD. Wowie! I feel so informed! I think we're ready for step two! Step two, ask them on a date. Ahem! Human, I, the Great Papyrus, will go on a date with you! Really? Wowie! I guess that means it's time for part three! Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Hmm. Wait a second. Wear clothing. That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now! Not only that, earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. No. Could it be? You've wanted to date me from the very beginning? Ah! No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! No! You're dating power! Nyeh. Nyeh. Don't think that you've bus bested me yet! I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating, and I never will! I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date! Behold! Yeah, what do you think of my secret style? No! A genuine compliment! However, we don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't escalate any further unless you find my secret. But that won't happen! I see, I see! You like caressing my biceps with a floating heart! But who doesn't? There's no secret to my legs! Just hard work and perseverance! Human souls are stronger than monster souls, but the soles of our shoes, on the other hand, are about the same. Holding my hands, I'll tell you the answer! No, I must resist! My hat. My hat. My hat! Yeah. Well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice! It's a present! A present? Just for you! Do you know what this is? Yeah, <laughs> that's right! You have no idea! So this appears to be spaghetti. This ain't any old plain... This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti finely aged in an oaken cask. And then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus! Oh, is that why his spaghetti tastes awful? Is it just because he's using really old pasta? Human! It's time to end this! There's no way this can go any further! You take a small bite. His face reflectively scrunches up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking! And by extension, me! Maybe even more than I do! Ah! Ah! No! Cuman, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Cuman, I want you to be happy too. Time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. 
I papyrus I um Boy, is it hot in here or is it just me? <laughs> oh, shoot. Cuban, I I'm sorry. I don't like you the way that you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that just because you flirted with me, I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I'd be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I've only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep being your cool friend and act like this never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for second best. <laughs> Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Platonically, of course. Well, gotta go! We did it. We beat dating. Alright, that was cool. All right, let's continue on to the wetlands. All right. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. All that gives me life and validation is explaining the echo flower. No one can know. Never trust a flower. One that, that's one of the contents of this world. Are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome! She's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. <laughs> what? Have you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. I'm going to Grillby's. Wanna come? Yeah, sure. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from my work. Over here, I know a shortcut. First shortcut, huh? Hey. Hey, everyone! Hey, Sans! Hi, Sans! Greetings, Sans! Hi, Sansy! Hey, Sans, weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? Nah, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Here, get comfy. Oops, wanna watch where you sit down. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seats. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? Hey, that sounds pretty good. Ruby, we'll have a double order of fries. Oh, what do you think? Oh, my brother. Of course he's cool. He'd be cool too. He'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. You'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. By that I mean he wears it in the shower. Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Bon appetit.
Oops. Eh, forget about it. You can have mine. I'm not hungry anyway. Anyways, cool or not, you have to agree that Papyrus tries real hard. Like how he keeps trying to be a part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. But the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him some warrior training. It's, uh, still a work in progress. Oh, yeah. I wanted to ask you something. Have you ever heard of a talking flower? So you know all about it. The echo flower. They're all over the marsh. Say something of them and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Virus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes, when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? Someone else is using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away for the from work for that long. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? I'm also flat broke! Yeah, just kidding. Roby, put it on my tab. By the way, I was gonna say something, but I forgot. Crikey. Hmm. Yo, do you think I could go up ahead first? I want to be the first one to see Undyne. See you up ahead, dude. I swear I saw something behind that rushing water. Huh? The camera behind- oh shit. Uh, hi, Undyne! I'm here with my daily report! Uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. I think, uh, how do I, huh? Did I fight them? Y yes, of course I did. I fought them valiantly. What? D did I capture them? Oh, well, no. I tried very hard, Undyne, but in the end, I failed. Uh, what? You're going to take the human soul yourself? But Undyne, you don't have to destroy them. You, you see, you see. I understand. I'll help you out in any way that I can. Did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome! I'm so jealous! What did you do to get her attention? <laughs> Come on, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. Sweet. 
that the monster kid never got like a proper name. Like imagine just someone calling you a human guy. Neat, I got 30 gold for the dog nating. Oh, hello. Hmm, I just get here. Yo, did you think that Undyne did it? I remember this thing. Responsibility. Oh, so they make it explicitly sans. That one. This is Papyrus. How'd I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got to yours. <laughs> so, what are you wearing? I'm I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a bandana. Is that true? Are you wearing a bandana? Oh, you are wearing a bandana. Got it. Wink, wink. Have a nice day. Long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes into the stars in the sky. You hope with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now, all we have, all we have, are these sparkling stones on the ceiling. Oh, now to wash one clean. It pops around excitedly. Green means clean. I did it. Of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. Come on, sis, make a wish. I wish my sister and I will see the real stars someday. Open the telescope. Ah, uh, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. <laughs> make out the words. War of the human and monsters. Why did the humans attack indeed? Seems I had they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. They will take the soul of nearly every monster. Just equal the power of a single humans. The humans are quite weakness. Weakness. Ironically it's the strength of their soul. It's power to persist outside of the human body even after death. If I find it, yeah. If a monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul, a horrible beast with unfathomable power. Blah, blah, blah. It's an illustration of a strange creature. 
There's something very unsettling about this drawing. Um, so I don't think this has been worked on as nearly as much as the other games. I don't know, nothing against the game, it's just it doesn't seem very different, so. Yo, did you see that? Undyne just touched me. I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky. If you were just standing a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure I'll see her again. <laughs> this juice has been here so long. Mag a magical crystal has formed around it, stuck to the table. Squeak. Yeah, I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally 500G to use this premium telescope, but since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? Satisfied? Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. Oh, where did all my items go? I relocated my store, but there's still no customers. Fortunately, I fought for a solution. Punch cards! Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have free cards, you can trade them for a free ice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. Yo, what's up, dude? I was going to buy some ice cream, but I forgot my gold at home. Haha. <laughs> what's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? I'm a superstar. Someday I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under. My heart. My heart is high. I want to fly. But there's no sky. I may have done it, overdone it a little. What is this bit for? coat to keep me dry, but I'm not a fan of being wet, you see. How ironic. I'm a fish that hates being wet.
Yeah, uh, sorry I'm not talking too much. I am very tired. Shoes. God damn it. Donkey, please don't give up. Have some determination. This is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about your clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very... Um, murdery. But I bet you knew that already! And because you knew that, I told her what you told me you were wearing. A bandana. Because I knew, of course, after such a suspicious question, you would obviously change your clothes! You're such a smart cookie. This way you're safe and I didn't lie. No betrayal anywhere! Being friends with everyone is easy! Is that steam? Oh. Hmm. Not dealing with y'all today. I fought coming a waterfall, I'd cheer up. But the waters just made me sadder. Short one bridge seed. Yo, dude, you think you could solve this one? Haha, <laughs> thanks. Oh, fuck me. Oh, found it. Oh, is this progress? It's rare to see a new face around a waterfall. Wait a minute, you're a human, aren't you? No. I see. I guess my memories of what they look like is foggy. It's a mushroom encased in crystal in a cyan crystal. <laughs> People like you are so rare. Please, stranger, tell me about the outside. Huh? Surface? What do you mean? I just meant outside this room. You haven't noticed? My mycelium has bound me to the ground. Please, stranger. I'll make this simple. I've spent my whole life in the same spot, in the same room. I've always wondered what lies inside the room to the right. Long I've fantasized about wintering and changing my scenery. No, changing my life. Please, go and tell me what's inside. Wait, is that a... Oh. Hey, where are you going? Oh, you're back. How's the room? Oh, that's a relief. That's all I need to continue my fantasies. Thank you, stranger. I feel like this is kind of bugged here. Oh, it's the onion sand bit. <laughs> hey! There, I noticed you were here! I'm onion sand! Onion sand, you hear? You're visiting waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too! It's my big favorite! 
so shallow here. I have to sit down all the time, but... Hey, that's okay. The beast's moving to the city. And living in a crowded aquarium. Like all my friends did. And the aquarium's full anyway, so... Even if I wanted to, I... That's okay, though. You hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? Hey there. That's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In waterfall! I fucking love onion sand. What, what? Oh yeah, Shiren! I'm a jazz. Shiren follows you, mode. You wave your arms wildly. You're now vulnerable to electric attacks. You wave your arms wildly. Okay, let's see if I can do it from memory. Yeah, I'm a genius. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? You're carrying too many dogs. You deployed the dog. No! The dog absorbed the artifact! The artifact is gone. Statue. The structure seems dry at its feet. The calm trickle of waterfall is ahead. Fills you with determination. Huh? Is that Rousey? Or is that a cat? Ah, oh, whatever. Are you gonna take an umbrella? Go ahead! I don't need one! Please take one. I took an umbrella. Now you're both protected from the rain! No, I can't run with you, Bella. Nah, I don't need that. I've already solved it. I'm, I'm a genius! You got an umbrella? Awesome! Let's go! <laughs> oh, he's the ball chime. Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats some bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night. Knowing she was gonna beat me up, huh? <laughs> oh. Where are you going there? So, one time, we had a school project where he had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, donated his own flowers. We had, he ended up teaching us about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. Um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. 
He's too cool to ever, ever hurt an innocent person. Hey, this isn't different. about me I'll always find a way to get through what is the rubber room with rats thing I don't understand it it's bridge time No. The bandana. It sounds like it came from over here. Oh, you've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up! Donkey, huh? That's a nice name. My name is... Oh, I'm doing this again. It's a rusty old fridge. Look inside. It's in some kind of spectral fruit. What are you taking? Got the ghost fruit. Alright. I know what's coming up. <clears throat> I know that the mad dummy's coming up, so we'll, we'll do that and then I think we'll be done for the night because I am getting tired. <laughs> it's cool, uh, it's... can't remember too much. <laughs> it's just like you to run away. I am a ghost that lives inside of a dummy! My cousin used to live inside a dummy, too, until... YOU CAME ALONG! When you talked to them, they thought they were in fact in for a nice chat! But the things you said! Horrible! Shocking! Unbelievable! It spooked them right out of their dummy! 
human! I'll scare your soul out of your body! Mad dummy blocks the way. Talk to the dummy. Doesn't seem like much of a conversation. No one is happy with this. Pitiful, pitiful, pitiful! You dummies! Watch where you're aiming your magic attacks! Hey, you! Forget I said anything about magic! I'll defeat you and take your soul! Mad Dummy is bossing around his bullets. I'll use your soul to cross the barrier! Stand in the window of a fancy window store. Ooh, I need a heal. And everything I want will be mine. Huh? Yeah, I guess I'll avenge my cousin. Hit once. What was their name again? Whatever, whatever, whatever. Foolish, foolish, foolish. Guys! Dummies, dummies, dummies! Remember how he said not to shoot at me? Well, failures! You're fired! You're all being replaced! <laughs> now you'll see my true power! Relying on people that aren't garbage! Funny. Dummy bots magic missile! Dummy bots, try again! Oh, aw, that missed just straight up. There we are. No, no way! These guys are even worse than the other guys! Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? I don't need friends! I've got knives! I'm out of knives. But it doesn't matter! You can't hurt me and I can't hurt you! You'll be still fighting me! Forever! 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 <laughs> what the heck is this? Ugh. Acid rain? Oh, forget it! I'm out of here! <laughs> Sorry, I interrupted you, didn't I? As soon as I came over, your friend immediately left. Oh no, you guys look like you were having fun. Oh no, I just wanted to say hi. Oh no. Well, I'm going to head home now. Oh, um, feel free to come with if you want. But no pressure. I understand if you're busy. It's fine. No worries. Just thought I'd offer.
Hey, my house is up here, in case you want to see, or in case you don't. What is over that fucking fish right there? Wrong. There's one last thing I- well, okay, I probably can't do it here, actually. Oh, hey, you're here. Hey there, you having fun? Well, I won't keep you for too long, but I want to give you some parting advice, at least. Remember, when life gives you lemons, you make... Mm, get back to me on that one, okay? Alright. I'm done. I'm done for today. I'm done for tonight. I am very tired. That was fun. Undertale bits and pieces. I think we're at the end of the cool new bits and pieces. But hey, I think we had a lovely time. I think. I don't know. I'm not sure. I've only played the game. So, yeah, thanks everyone for coming around, for hanging out, and for being a part of the stream. I'm gonna go and end the stream.